Hello, welcome to Edirol Orchestral Tutorial. In first part, we saw how to automate volume and pan with the MIDI out plugin. In this tutorial, I will show you how to automate volume with the knobs and sliders on your MIDI controller keyboard. So let's begin the tutorial. Here we open Orchestral. Now we open the MIDI out plugin. We make the changes to the port. And here, one. Let's increase the volume a bit. Okay, now to automate the volume slider with uh, the knob or slider on your MIDI controller, just click the right click the slider. So here it is. Now remember this number, controller number 7. Now from the browser, under the current project, we click generators and fruity wrapper and right click this number, MIDI control change number 7, link to controller and now turn the knob or slider on your MIDI controller. So I'll be pressing the key on my nano key. Let's see whether it is registered okay so the volume slider is uh, registered with my midi controller now let's uh, record few notes Okay, I played some random notes there and now we'll automate the volume for flute so let's record the volume automation Okay, I don't have the knob on my MIDI controller, so I cannot move the turn the volume uh, gradually. I am pressing the key. If you have the knob, you can gradually increase or decrease the volume. Okay, so now let's see whether we have done it correctly. See the volume automation is done here, but not according to what we want. So if we want to further edit the volume automation changes, we go in the piano roll, then under velocity, click that small arrow, and now click here, orchestral MIDI control change 7. From here we can automate or increase or decrease. Let's play the notes. Here I can make the final adjustments. Now I decrease the volume. 
Iya. Now let's watch the slider. Volume slider here. See how the volume automation is done. And now the volume decreases gradually. So this is how we make the volume automation right from your MIDI controller. Now I'll show one more thing here in the edit section. I'll show the how the tone of that uh, particular instrument can be enhanced. So we just uh, right click. We remember the control controller number 18. And from the browser, I click generators and then Ruti wrapper and controller number 18. Link to controller, right? And then again press uh, knob or slider on your MIDI controller. So I'll be pressing the key here. Let's see. Yes. That key is registered with the Eddie Rolls character. Now let's uh, record the tonal character. See, you can hear the change in the tone of that instrument. Let's hear once again. See, the knob is changing. And uh, hear the tone of that instrument. So this is how we can uh, automate the any, any function here out here, any parameter, just right click and then from the browser you can uh, attach that uh, controller to your midi controller knob or slider so in this tutorial we saw how to automate uh, volume and uh, other parameters uh, in my next tutorial we'll see how to automate the patch changes i hope you enjoyed this tutorial thank you